Hello and welcome to another episode of Saki Nagi. Fat. You can't say that. Fat git. Man, why is it when you always get in the car, the first thing you think about? <gasps> why is it the first thing you always think about? Shut up. A sweet. Clever guy. Because when you've had a coffee or a fry up in the morning, yeah. you always get that aftertaste. It's not a very nice aftertaste. You have That's to have right. a mint mm -hmm. to get rid of the aftertaste. A mint. Mm. A mint or a licorice. Huh? A mint or a licorice or an orange or a banana or just plain or treacle. You don't like treacle. I like any sort of topic. You to don't, because you moan at me. No, I don't moan at you. What I actually point out is that of the myriad of flavours that we've got, in fact, it's best if I put somewhere where we're going. Let's go to the car wash. Have I got a car wash in here? Hmm? Car wash? I have. I Let's have. all go to the car wash. You're defeating the object, really, because you're going to the car wash and it's peeing it down. Yeah, yeah, I knew you'd come out with that. <laughs> right. Why am I having the car washed? Because it's dirty. Right, and what's the rain going to do? Dirt it. Right, is the rain going to wash it? Is it going to wash away the bird muck? Is it going to make the windows better? Is it going to clean all the top of it off the floor by you? I don't think so, is it? No. Anyway, <clears throat> all right, do you think? Yep, well done, just done the three claps. And just for the benefit of somebody who watches it after, that is to synchronise all the audio. The international viewer, not viewers. Uh, we have many. Oh, speaking of which, one of the international viewers uh, spoke to me yesterday and he's having trouble understanding the English. So, as a consequence, he switched on the captions so that what we say is actually translated into English, right? It's like a translation sort of come caption thing. It's automatic if you watch the video, enable it. And we tried it and we understand what he means. So the whole thing about what we're talking about, what we're doing, where we're going and the words that we use come up with something totally different. And um, it's not that the humour he has trouble with, it's understanding what the hell we're talking about. And when I say we, I actually mean um, you. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, when you look at it and you watch how it translates, it, it's oh, sugar. What is that? That was nearly a sweary word. I want you to go to the co op, to the cash point. I need, have you got any money on you at all? You haven't told no. me because you need to go. Did you pick my 10 quid up? Yeah. Right, so I need a bit more uh, for my car wash. And I didn't want to come this way, I wanted to go a different way. In fact, today, to be fair, we're going to go a nice, like, scenic route because there is a really nice run rather than going on uh, some of the, the main roads. Um, and it does look really good. Except the weather's a bit dank and grey. Nice. Yeah. What do you mean not nice? I'd well, considering we've had some really horrible hot weather, this is this is a refreshing. This is yeah. I had somebody when I was uh, streaming yesterday. Mm. Somebody was. Not me. I heard somebody going on about uh, the fact that it's 14 degrees and it's freezing. I was laughing. 14 yeah. degrees is great. Mm. It's easy to keep warm. It's yeah. really difficult to keep cold. Yeah. Well, you should be able to keep warmer than most. Who, me? Mm. Why me? Because of the excess light. You know. What? Go on. Um, well, seals... Speak before you speak. OK, do I put this? Seals manage to keep warm in the Arctic waters. What are you doing? Nothing. I'm just trying to... I'll tell you what. Before you even say anything. If you got stranded, right, on an island in Iceland with some Eskimos. Yeah, go on. 
for, I don't know, maybe three or four weeks. Yeah. Right? Say there was 20 Eskimos in you, right? So I'm thinking this one up as I'm going along here, it sounds good in my head, so I'm laughing already, I do apologise. That was just for the people. The and uh, people. Yeah. And uh, say you were stranded uh, uh, on an island in Iceland, right, with 20 Eskimos in you for six months, right? Who would be the survivors? I don't know, but see if you were stranded on an island in Iceland, right, with 20 Eskimos, they'd have a field day. They'd have food for the whole year. Hang on a minute. If you were there, right, you'd be lighting the homes, feeding the children, <laughs> doing the cooking. See if you were stranded, I'd leave you. I wouldn't even just Hang on. bother with you. It's you, not you. Shut it. That's why, right, that's why our international viewers have trouble understanding what we're talking about. What, because of your accent? No, because you don't even use English. Yes, I do. Oh, yeah. 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 What's yeah? Is it your? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, well. It's no good learning English now. It's just bad education. That's a trouble down south. I think we should speak quite properly down south. Properly. Mm, properly. Your diction is adequate. <laughs> Not. Right, we're just basically filling in a bit of time there while we go to the cash pot. You want 20? Uh, yes, please. Where's your card? Um, it's in your bag, isn't it? No. What's in your bag? You are joking me, Mel, seriously. You didn't ask me to look after your card. You asked me to look after your phone. That's all you gave me. Have you got it in there? Yeah. Oi! Now I'm going to have to edit that out. Just beep it. Well, the thing is, you never remember what I give you and what I don't give you, and that's the problem. You don't remember the good times when I buy your bag of crisps with your favourite flavour. Why have you got a coat on? Because why do you think? Well, watch the door. Don't slam the door. Shut up, Mel! Put your head on the camera, you scared everybody now. <laughs>